Hey guys, just wanted to say thank you so much for the fantastic response. It's unbelievable how many of you guys uh, say good things about the vlog. Thanks for all the suggestions too. We already started filming some other training vlogs where we try to keep that stuff in mind. I just wanted to create a little bit of an intro for this vlog that we filmed, that I filmed all the way back in June. Um, I got to go on a really cool experience. I got to go with the Black Diamond athlete team uh, after the athlete summit to Lander. Um, there's a little bit of a weird, well you guys will see in the video, but basically it was kind of hard to film a lot of the climbing. Uh, I got some cool footage of me sending some hard stuff and uh, just sharing my experience and my thoughts. So hope you guys enjoy a little bit of my insight uh, and just sharing my experience in Lander. Uh, it's a beautiful, beautiful place and I was really lucky to be able to go. Uh, shout out to Black Diamond for letting me film and letting me come on the trip. Shout out to Adam Peters, my athlete manager for inviting me and letting me go. Um, and stay tuned for more episodes. We'll see you guys later. A skirt? This is Ellie. This is Ross's Hi. sister. <laughs> What's it? up? What's up? So what is this, Ross? Could you give us a little uh, background? Black Salt Lake City and Climbers and Lions. Yeah. It's like this big fundraising event they do every year. It's my first time coming to check it out, so it's cool to see the whole scene. So they've got a bunch of vendors and booths everywhere. Yeah. So apparently the uh, SLCA just uh, fundraises all for a lot of climbers to be able to do stuff here and like brands and whatever. So it's big, big, big fundraising like hangout, I guess. A lot of people. We're gonna go say hi to people. What's up? Yeah. <laughs> I guess they're doing a, they spin. Brennan has the record. He's on 30. You do a spin and then, woo! Let's go! Come on, man! 52! What is that? 73? What? 98! Wow! 98 pull-ups, new record. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, that looked like it, it looked like it went in. Oh, that was so close. Yeah! <laughs> yeah, Carlo. Dude, it's kind of hot. It feels good, no? Go, Christian. Oh! <laughs> Bye, Ross. Bye, Tim. See you after the weekend. Yeah. Bye. Bye it's still going strong. It's like 9 o'clock. We've been here for like three hours, but... We're finally going. Um, I got to meet a lot of the, the pro athletes, which is pretty cool. So I'm gonna get my stuff, meet up with the team at the van, and then we're driving to Lander. So we made it to the Lander. Oh. Oh, that was a long drive. See you guys tomorrow. All right, so we're wearing new clothes. And we uh, had breakfast with the squad, pretty late start. And we're about to head on over to the crag. Or we're gonna get some lunch and go to the crag. Cause he's that guy. Dude, you're gonna carry that all the way up? No. Oh. I'm gonna have someone else carry it. <laughs> <laughs> That's what they're for. <laughs> That's the quote of the video. <laughs> we're hiking. This is the crux of the trip. It's crossing the street. Easy. <laughs> <laughs> Loading up. This is Adam Peters, everybody. This is the BD athlete manager. He's the man, he's a legend. Actual legend, Bronco Peters. Go check him out, he makes a lot of leather stuff, custom made. <laughs> Come to me for leather underwear. That's my specialty. <laughs> I know you have a pair somewhere. Kettle chips, too. Jalapeno. Dude, that's an epic view. This is Wild Iris. Yeah, now it's cold. It's gonna be cold. Colder. Dude, this is sweet. So I don't, I'm pretty sure I'm not allowed to film the vast majority of this stuff. So I'm gonna leave the camera behind and tell you guys about it later. Yeah, 
All right, success. We're, we're back in the van and uh, we're going back for dinner. I'll give you guys an update later. That was a savage day. Solo update. So yeah, the day was awesome. So the reason why I didn't film like anything today was because I was meeting all these like pretty high profile athletes for the first time. And like, I didn't want to like have a camera up in everyone's face and be a goofball, you know? So like they didn't know who I was. And anyway, just wanted, I really wanted to like climb and have an authentic experience like in Lander, you know, while I risk myself and you know, climb with them, meet with them, talk to them. But yeah, so it was uh, it was awesome. So Sam and I got to climb together. We did like a couple warm ups together, a couple harder stuff together. Yeah, it was dope. I had to like, I mean, this is my first time in Wild Iris and, and Lander, and and I got to do like one five ten, one five eleven, one five twelve, one five thirteen, and one five fourteen, which is like pretty sick. I've never done that in a day, and like yeah, I ended up flashing my first five fourteen, which is pretty sick. And it was amazing, pretty cool moves. There was like two monos on it. It was disgusting, but like it was uh, it was pretty savage. Uh, I ended up trying pretty hard on it and I had a good time. Um, but yeah, tomorrow we're gonna shoot. I think Connor Hurston's gonna join us, which is dope because I you know kind of grew up training with Connor sometimes. Like and it, he, he grew up, you know, we grew up in the same gym. He's a Black Diamond Pro. And these are all like Black Diamond Pro athletes, like global athletes. And uh, yeah, it's just like an athlete summit that they do like annually. And I got invited really last minute. I was really glad that they were to have me, but Anyway, tomorrow we're going to be doing kind of the same thing, but a little bit chiller. But yeah, hopefully you guys will get a flavor a bit tomorrow. All right, hitting the peace. This Yo. is Connor Harrison. Come on, Connor. Uh-oh. Change that corner, Connor. <laughs> yep. <laughs> On the ledge. Yeah, I'm glad. I was, I was getting all the young person jokes made at me yesterday, so yeah. we're gonna have to flip them on Connor. <laughs> I think I'm gonna get an equal amount, maybe more. Yeah, how do I say, uh, how do I say I love rock climbing in Spanish? Ah, uh, eh, me encanta escalar. Me encanta? Me encanta, me encanta escalar. escalar. Me encanta escalar. Wait, what? We love rock climbing. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, every footage. <laughs> Wait, why are they descending? We're going up. Come on, Hazel. Oh. All right, so couple shenanigans so we've been climbing on the this huge overhang which is awesome Connor just on-sighted Cowboy King which is like the hardest 13b it's like the hardest one here and it's like super classic good job Connor thanks that was sick that was super cool but bad bad news the uh, a ranger came by a ranger came by and just like shut down the whole thing because apparently apparently like we didn't have the right permitting. You need to get like some commercial permitting before you do stuff at like this area specifically. The vlog is gonna be the thing now. Yeah, he can't shut me down. Yeah, he can't shut me down. Watch him try. He ain't shutting down the vlog.
All right, well, we, we sent in the rain. Connor had the, the crazy sun. Jacopo like missed all the holds and then it just started downpouring on me. Like you can kind of see the rock is insane. Changes color. Yeah, it's super obvious. This is dry and this is wet. So the entire slab was wet and it's like kind of no hands right here. Like all the chalk goes away. So I just had no idea what the sequence was. The top was dry though, which was nice. Hello. Um, so obviously I'm back in Salt Lake now and it's a couple days later because now my, my hair is short. Um, but I just wanted to film an outro and just kind of highlighting what this lander trip was kind of about. Um, and I was pretty stoked to be able to have this opportunity to hang out with, you know, BD pros and stuff, but also just check out a new area. And the main thing I wanted to highlight in this outro was paying attention to impact. Obviously it's a little bit hypocritical because we had, you know, a crew of like 20 of us going to a really fragile area. Um, that was like pretty quiet and low key. Um, but the stuff to just pay attention to, you know, don't be super noisy, pick up trash if you see it, don't leave anything behind. You know, if there's like really crowded areas and really crowded like spots in the place that you're at, just like maybe try to plan on not going in that area during that time. It's stuff that we were trying to practice as well. Um, so even though we had a big group, there were still, you know, practices that you can do that kind of minimize your impact. But yeah, these places are really special and there's a lot of you know, groups and communities out there that allow us to be able to go climb. Um, and for me, like that was growing up, going to Bishop and Red Rocks and um, like even Rifle um, and now Lander, like these, these places have like really um, sensitive communities and like fragile environments. Take care of the place that you're trying to go to. I'm glad I got to go. Glad I got to share a little bit with you guys and uh, we'll see you guys soon.